Check this out. What'd you find? You're on this old poster. First the statue of Taylor, and now this? What the hell is going on? That isn't me. Can't see for shit. Jesus! The water looks black. I don't want to go anywhere near it. Okay. Who's first up? Huh. Professor? You keep telling us you're in charge, so... Okay. Sure thing. Is it safe to cross? Don't stress. The professor and me will make sure you get across, no problem. Right, we'll, we'll get you over for sure. Can't stay here. In this year of our Lord, 1692, we are here present to bear witness to a just execution. No! Amy is declared guilty of consorting with the devil and is to be drowned as a witch and sorceress. Let us pray in silence for her soul. I've done no wrong. I am no witch. I do not deserve death. I beg you. I don't know how to help you. Tell me what I can do. Please, sir. You must help me. You must. The devil is in the wind, seeking to help his own. He would release her from the chains. Isaac, let us conclude our business here swiftly. The will of the court must be imposed before it's too late. The devil fortifies her. You must bind her tightly. You cannot do this! Isaac, I am innocent. fulfill the will of the court. Send this witch back into the lap of her master, lest he come for Lily. us all. Little Hope is already lost, shrouded in evil. But not as you claim from witchcraft or outside demons, we are poisoned from within. You will not save yourself with riddles. There is no riddle. The devil takes many forms. You know that better than any. In Little Hope, he has hid himself under a shroud of innocence, taken the form of a child by accuser. While Mary still draws breath, little hope remains beyond salvation. There lies your evil reference in your very face. Isaac.
What did you see? Tell me. I don't know how to tell you what I just saw. Your double was pushed into the river in chains. She drowned. All right, I'll go first. <clears throat> okay, you two, get on down here. Phew, that was really quite close for Angela. She was almost lost to a fate worse than death. Not that there's anything particularly wrong with death. <laughs> well done. Not a soul lost so far. Things could have been quite different. Given the way in which the stakes have been uh, elevated, some kind of weapon might be useful about now, don't you think? You really should have explored more thoroughly, you know. Too late now. The boys have some interesting theories. Could they, as Andrew has suggested, be the reincarnated souls of their historical counterparts? Or maybe you're choosing to believe Daniel's theory that they're already dead. My dream was lengthened after life. Oh, then began the tempest to my soul. I passed, methought, the melancholy flood with that sour ferryman, which poets write of unto the kingdom of perpetual night. <laughs> it's possible, I suppose. Maybe the bus driver can shed some light. This must be very confusing for you right now. Doppelgangers, witches, ghosts, death, and demons. What could possibly tie all of these souls together? I dare say we'll find out, hmm? I have been granted permission to give you a single hint. Tempted? <laughs> Okay, then. We will once again turn to the Bard for some 
cryptic inspiration. I met him once, you know. I meet everybody once. Act five, scene one, where Cleomenes begs Leontes to forgive himself for causing the death of Hermione. Do as the heavens have done. Forget your evil. With them, forgive yourself. Go on then. As terrifying as it might be, you should get back to it. anything like it. It was like something from a nightmare. Did you see the way it looked? The gaping mouth, those dead soulless eyes? Whatever it was, it's gone now. I was nearly gone. If that thing had caught me, it was so close. You've had the crap scared out of you. We all have. But at least we got the fuck away from it. We did. Thank God we're all okay. Right now, we're safe. That thing, whatever the fuck it was, is still out there. Could be hunting us as we speak. It was in chains. Just like the woman who went in the water. I don't believe that's coincidence. Either of you see what happened to Taylor and Daniel? They can't be far behind us. Let's just get out of here. places to end up. Let's get out of here. We've got to get away from here. That thing is out there.
Who would bring flowers here? Poor guy died young. Let's stay away from that bridge. I'm all for putting as much distance between us and that hideous thing as we can. Pretty sure Daniel and Taylor would be thinking the same thing. Out of sight, quick! Best to keep out of his way, I reckon. We should talk about what the woman said before they drowned her. The little girl has to be stopped. She was talking about stopping the witch trials, right? I'm not sure. Come on, let's go. I'll go in and take a look around. How you doing? You holding up okay? How am I holding up? Let's see, a radioactive mutant gargoyle tried to scarf down our classmates. Our leader, the professor, has turned into a boy scout. We're stuck in a creepy little shithole town with fuck you up fog. And there are way out of date wackos talking witchy bullshit all over. I'm real good. How about you? Truth be told, I'm still shaken up a little from the crash. How could I forget? We were in a bus wreck too. Gets better and better. What's that? Nothing, probably. I heard something.
I don't like this. I want to go another way. Don't think there is another way. Not a place I want to revisit. Quite the tourist trail. You need to come take a look at this. That thing could still be around here. In the water. No, we left that thing way behind. We must have. Oh, shit. You're going first, right? You weigh half what I do. Better if you lead. I'm not crossing this crapped out bridge, no way. To find the others we got across. We got no choice. Fuck hooking up with those guys. This is me and you now. We gotta look out for ourselves. <sighs> I'll go out in front then. You see what I'm seeing? This whole place is one giant memorial to death. Let's get out of here. <gasps> Daniel! <gasps> get your hands off us! Oh, wait. I'll pick you. Mary? Mary? Mary, the fountain of all evil is here. That little kid is the evil here? I don't, I don't get it. My beloved Amy proclaimed it so with her dying testimony. If this evil is to end, Mary must be stopped. That child is trouble, but... You can't believe she's really evil. There it lies. I found it. How did you come by this? Fashioned with my own hand. I take it to protect you. Suspicion and betrayal walk side by side in Little Oak. No one is safe. Please, Tabitha, let me keep it. Nothing. No working phone anywhere. Okay, so it looks like we really are trapped here. Still no sign of him? Nope. Not yet. I just hope they're both okay. I figured we'd have found the bus driver by now. Wonder where he's at. Why can't you leave us alone? I... I think she wants us to go after her. You want to follow her? She could be leading us into danger, even a trap. The two girls we've seen. One is from the past, 
This one is from here and now. Maybe the girl we're seeing here is somehow a mirror image of the girl from the 17th century. Don't you want to wait for Daniel and Taylor? If they were coming this way, they'd be here by now. Stay loose. Who knows what's up ahead? Hey, wait for us! Shoo! Ugh! Disgusting! Guys? You there? Let me get down there. Angela? You still down here? It's John. You okay down there? I'm good. That's all there was. Nothing else. There's something blocking the door. Give me a hand, will ya? This place is a museum of some kind. She in there? Relax. This doesn't feel right. Stay focused. We're not having a rerun of what just happened to Angela. You sure about that? I'll do whatever it takes to keep us both safe. Once we're out of here, we'll hook up with the others. That's if they're still alive. Why is this kid out here on her own? It's strange. Maybe she's linked to Mary somehow? Gotta be. 
Though how and why, I'm not sure of yet. Disturbing. It creeped the hell out of me. This is what the trial was all about. People being in cahoots with the devil. Right. And this kid, Mary, who snitched on everyone. That's gotta be the girl we're seeing. Come take a look at this. I've seen this before. Where? On the road outside that shitty little bar we stopped at. Angela and me saw it laying there, picked it up. Right before that kid Mary scared us for the first time. Interesting. You think she maybe let us here? Wanted us to see this? Let's take a proper look. What the hell, Professor? There are many, many stories about how spirits can attach themselves to objects. Sure, in movies. Take it easy, will you? What if Mary's spirit is somehow attached to this thing? We burn it, and this could all end right here. Look at it another way. Maybe by burning her precious things, it's just gonna piss the kid off. Trust me, I know what I'm doing here. Right. Sure. It's not worth taking a chance on. And it ain't bringing Angela back either. Let me do it if you're not up for it. I take full responsibility. Seriously? What is wrong with you? Think that worked. I gotta say, I'm not so sure.
Hey, we can get out this way. I got a good feeling about this. Burning it was the right move. Almost out of juice. No signal out here anyway. What the fuck was that? No idea. Guys? Professor? That you in there? Can we just get out of here? Where the hell are the others? Probably as lost as us. You think they're looking for us? Could be. Angela's got no interest in finding me. That's for sure. She's got a mean streak, all right. But she's got some heart. <laughs> you sure about that? Yeah. I've known her for a long time. Longer than any of you. All right. Ten bucks says no one's home. I'm not touching that. Still, first place we've seen in a while. Find a way in? Like you found a way into that store? You a burglar in your spare time? <laughs> no. But I was in a past life. <sighs> Fucking door. 